Hey everyone, I'm back with another fan here, this time with a an Emerson, pre, not a premium, I thought I was getting a premium, but it turned out to just be a modern designer series. So this is basically, I believe, an Emerson designer series with a top light. And I'm going to demonstrate the light. It's got a top light, and a, as well as I added a bottom light kit, standard light kit. You can either add this kind of light kit or a four-armed light kit or a three-armed. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to test each of the lights. So this pull chain is part of the switch housing. Ah, let me just get that switch on. Oop. Oh, I know why. Oops, wrong button. Okay, there's the... There's the top light, bottom light. Let's see what they draw. Draws 0 0.70, 0 0.7 with both lights. Let's uh, turn off the lights and uh, take a look at it. I'm gonna turn off the bottom light. There's the top light. If you want an accent, like in your living room, a top light is very nice for that. Bottom light. Let's see what each of them, when each of them draw. The bottom light draws 0.49. Let's just do top light alone. 0.2, and that's just that top light. All right. So that's just something I think is cool, you know, having a top light. Okay, and uh, now to do the fan tests, starting with low, and it is drawing uh, 0.22, and of course this is basically a Casablanca Panama, it's almost identical to it, so it's basically going to give me the same low as a Casablanca. It's got the same kind of motor, it has a K55, so. All right, so 0.22, let's, uh, I'm gonna do uh, medium. Oh, let me get up on the ladder. And of course you notice I like yellow tassel pull chains. A childhood thing of mine when looking at fans in people's houses. And even in my own house growing up, we had those on our fans. So it's definitely something I like having on mine. Medium draws 0.49. Okay. Let me just feel that. It's actually a nice breeze. It's pretty strong for medium. Here comes high. Okay, it's drawing 0 0.81. 0 0.81 on high. So let's do spin down. And I'm gonna do reverse. Let me get the reverse switch. Okay. Yeah, it wobbles a little more because it's on a J-hook. I have it hanging on a J-hook for testing, but it's usually stable a lot more on a ball socket. That's what this comes mounted with. Got the canopy right there and the mounting bracket. But I have this one available either for sale or for an install. You know, if you're someone local and want want me to come install if you're look interested in this fan I would otherwise I might try this in my bedroom I wouldn't mind having an accent light as well as the main light so I'd still have longer pull chains even though I have wall controls just so I can go between top light and um, bottom light 
got kind of a long, definitely a long spin down. It's just like a Casablanca, so. It's a nice shape, too. It got a few dings, but. Well, not dings, but, you know, paint chips, but other than that. It's a nice white fan. I may just, uh, otherwise, I might put it in here as well. Put it where the Enigma is and grab one of the uh, Emerson Industrials, put that where the gold line is. If, if I want to have an Emerson pair, be like a residential Emerson and an industrial Emerson. That'd make a nice pair as well. I thought of doing that, but, I mean, if someone likes this fan and, okay. Time for a reverse. Oh, did I uh, not uh, do low? Okay. Yeah, I forgot to change the pull chain to low, but now it's on low. And it's also drawing 0.22. All right, here's medium. And wobbles a bit more on the. Yeah, it stables out, but it seems to wobble more on reverse. Well, at least when it's mounted on this J hook, so. 0.49. Same, so I'm getting identical, just like with a Casablanca. Here's high. Here's reverse on high. Geez, I'm feeling the breeze bouncing off the ceiling here, so. Alright. And it is and it's drawing a little bit less than high on reverse. It's actually drawing 0.77. Interesting. Yeah, flat between 0.77, so a little bit less, less on uh, reverse, so I'm going to flip it back, and we're going to do decade box and wall controls. Okay, I'm going to try my trick. Ah, I went too far. Okay. Well, I guess I gotta stop it by hand. I'm still not good at this trick, so... <laughs> yeah, what can you do? Alright. Let's see where it starts. One. Two. Let's start on two. No, three. Huh. Huh, what? Hold on, let's... Okay, it's on, okay, making sure that it's on high. wonder if it just... I don't know. Let's uh, try it again. One, two, three. Okay, starts on three. Point one four. Four. Four point one nine. Five. Point two four. So I'm pretty much, I call it right on the money with, uh, with factory low. Six. Point two eight. Seven. Point three three eight point three seven. So I know I have a Casablanca control here that's a five eight thirteen. So this would be your this would be your low medium. 
9.41, here's 10.45, here's 12.48, 13.48, 14.48, 15.48, 12.48, So this is like you're right on the money for factory medium. Maybe it's just slightly more. 14.53. 15.56. 16.58. 17.6. 18.62. 19.64. 20. 0.66. So you're definitely safe with any uh, wall control capacitor based because. Uh, because I'm at 20 and I'm still way under, under that 0.81, so 0.67 for 21, 22, 0.69, 23, I want to see if I hit a resonant frequency, 24, 25, at 0.71, I'm just going to go with 27, 0.73, 29, 0.74, 30, I'm at 0.75. Let's just do 31, still at 0 0.75, 32, still 33, 34, 35, 0 0.76, 38, 0.77, 40. Okay, so I'm a little bit under, I'm close to high, but uh, let's flip high. And uh, basically I still got a little bit left, so I really don't hit, I don't hit a resonant frequency with this ca capacitor control. So, next is the solid state to see how this reacts, see how noisy it is. I don't know how I'll tell with this band playing. So, All right, solid state time. All right, I'm turning it up. Okay, it starts on the solid state with 0.19. Gonna go up. 0 0.27, 0 0.26, up a little more, 0.33. That's just here. I really can't tell in this video, but I like to do it anyways. I don't even hear anything. It doesn't even hum. It's so faint, actually. Let's see. I barely hear it. You definitely will not hear it. So it's definitely very suitable on the solid state. K55s are. I'm just going to go up to straight up noon, 0.53. Almost, you can use it in your bedroom almost on a solid state if you wanted. 0 0.62, 0 0.7, I'm just going to bring it to high and I get 0 0.79 on solid state high. Again, just very slightly under the factory high, but really close. So the last thing I do in this test is uh, zero to high, just to see what the inrush current is on this one. All right. All right. 
I'm gonna put it on the meter. 0.886. And it's dropping as it's accelerating. 0.82. Point eight one. Okay, so point eight six was its inrush current, so now it's dropped. Well, that's all I have for this Emerson uh, designer, which I thought was a premium at first, but I forgot it has standard blade brackets like a Casablanca and not uh, not those V-shaped things that interlock with each other. So, but it's a habitat find on Fanimation trip, so. Anyone that's interested in this, especially locally, I'll do an install for you. If you like this for an install, if you're a friend of mine that's local, that's maybe not a collector, so. But otherwise, that's all I have for this uh, Emerson designer. And I'll see you next time.